It is a great time of year to be getting out in the garden, whether you're working in it or just kicking back, enjoying spring. And I've got the perfect outdoor bench seat for that. This bench seat is actually quite clever. It's got the triple threat going on. It's a seat, it's also a storage facility, and you can wheel it around the yard, wheelbarrow style, to wherever you want it to be. Now, the first job is someone else's. You just get them to cut your material to size so that your first job is just to assemble. Glue and screw. Quite simply, this bench seat is just a box out of 15 mil structural ply. All up, the ply was $110. If you're attaching the back to a box, or in this case, this is actually the base, it's just upside down, you want to line up the short side of your box and screw that off. That makes squaring up the rest of the box a lot easier. Well, there it is. One box looking a little bit naked, though, and you wouldn't go out in the backyard without any clothes on, would you? So, I'm going to dress this box in a Merbau suit. Now, at first glance, it looks just like decking, but have a look at this. It's a lot thinner. This stuff is for screening and perfect for this because it's cheaper and more lightweight. A rule of thumb in the trade is to make sure that your screw length is three times the thickness of the material that you're attaching. Now, you can see that the ply is a little bit thin for those sort of screws, so putting some battens on the inside that'll give me a solid purchase. If you like the look of your boards pulled up close together, then go for it. But I've worked the height of this box out to allow for a 10 mil gap. For this top runner Merbau down either side of the box, I'm actually extending the pieces a little bit. That creates handles for the wheelbarrow effect. And to make it more comfortable to hold, just cutting a little curve out of the bottom. To give this bench seat some wheelbarrow mobility, I'm going to put some wheels at one end and at the other, a couple of treated pine legs. Time for the lid. I've just got a sheet of ply. It's five millimetres bigger than the dimensions of the box in both directions. And you need that clearance because timber moves and you don't want your lid to stick. Now, just like the box, I'm dressing the lid in Merbau. I'm even going so far as to put a skirt on it. That's around the outside, and the skirt actually helps you locate the lid on top of the box. Just like in the base of the bench seat, I'm putting down some battens to give me something to screw the slats to. Make sure you leave enough room either side so your lid can still slide down easily over the top. Then I'm spacing out the slats in the lid as I did earlier. Finish the job off with a couple of coats of sealer. It's a wheelbarrow storage unit and bench seat all rolled into one. With something like this in your yard, it won't just be the flowers looking good this spring.